Hello everyone. Thank you for tuning in. Today, we're bringing you some optimistic news amid the long and challenging journey we've all been facing with COVID-19. The Nightingale facility in Belfast, which at its recent peak was expanded to care for up to 32 critically ill COVID-19 patients, has successfully completed its de-escalation. This development has been described as significant by the Belfast Health Trust. The Nightingale, situated at the Belfast City Hospital's Tower Block, had reopened in October due to the pressures of the pandemic and was initially transformed into a 230-bed unit for critically ill patients back in April 2020. It stood as a crucial bastion in the battle against the virus, serving the community by providing vital care during the most trying times of the health crisis. Now, this de-escalation does not signal a stop in care for COVID-19 patients in the region, from now on, COVID-19 patients will be taken care of at the Mater Hospital on Crumlin Road, while the Belfast City Hospital will pivot its focus back to surgeries. In fact, the Belfast City Hospital will continue to provide care and treatment to patients across a range of specialities, including hematology and renal services, evolving into what is being referred to as a green surgical pathway. This entails maintaining an environment where COVID-19 positive patients are not cared for, ensuring that the site remains COVID-free to carry out complex, high-priority surgeries for patients from all across Northern Ireland. However, flexibility is key in these unpredictable times. The Trust asserts that while the hospital will be scaled up to undertake vital surgeries, it will retain adaptability, should there be another surge in COVID-19 cases. Details on the surgical recovery plan are still on the horizon, with more specific information expected to be released in the coming days. The journey through this pandemic has indeed been a collective one, and while the standing down of the Nightingale is a positive stride, remaining vigilant and adhering to health guidelines continues to be paramount. The ability to navigate through these challenging times is reflective of a community's strength, unity, and resilience. So let's continue to be mindful, safeguarding our loved ones and our communities. Thank you for joining us in today's update. For more information and updates on COVID-19, please ensure to subscribe to our channel and stay informed.